Hi there, welcome back. I'm back in Free Code Camp now, um, having moved house, so it sort of took a while to uh, get all settled. But yeah, doing the basic algorithm scripting, and we're on title case a sentence. Um, so for this one, we want to return the provided string with the first letter of each word capitalized. Make sure the rest of the word is in lowercase. Um, so as you can see in this example, we're taking in I'm a little teapot and we are returning a, the same string um, just with each word of the well, first letter of each word capitalized and the rest are lowercase here. Um, and obviously we're doing all words. So anything like the of an a as well. Um, we can see here as well if the word going in sort of uh, the word well the, the letters after the first word are uppercase we actually need to return that as lowercase here um, so i'll show you sort of my method how i did this and i think it's it's pretty quick let me know if there's a sort of a quicker version or you've come up with a better solution um, but i'm just going to delete that first line here and to begin with we're going to create an array of words um, so we'll do str.split and we're going to split it on the space here so this is going to create an array um, <clears throat> or uh, containing strings of each each of these words here and if you remember this example here where short and stout we actually want all of these words to be lowercase to begin with so between string uh, that we're passing in and split we're going to put two lowercase as a method and that will just lowercase everything before we split it. So like so. And if I just console.log uh, words, just return a string here, um, we should be able to see. There we are. So there's our array of words, um, as we can see here. So that's all good. Next, what we would want to do is essentially sort of have a new array. So I'm just going to do um, let new uh, array equal uh, empty array here, just to begin with. Um, and then we can actually do a, a for loop. And I've done a for of loop because um, I actually quite like the syntax here where we'll do for let word of words. And essentially this is going through each of the words um, or the, the individual words in the array now. And all we want to do is new array dot push. All right. And so for each of the words, we want to push the word and then the position zero of that character dot to uppercase. So I think it's like that. And then we want to also add um, sort of words or word dot slice. And then it would be one and then that should then be the rest of that uh, that word effectively <clears throat> and then we just want to return new array dot join and obviously we're joining on the space again i believe so yeah if i hit enter we can see that passes all of the tests um so just to go over this again and sort of make sure it's it's clear we're starting up here we're basically creating an array of words and they're all lowercase so um, on this input array, or a string, we're creating an array here. And then we're basically initializing a new array. And that's what we're going to push th this to. And with the for of loop, so this works the same. I could do this as sort of a, a for, for loop, classic for loop with the sort of index or the, the iterator. Um, but this is quite a nice syntax because we don't need the index um, of these words or um, the individual ones. We would actually only need it here. Um, and that is to get the, the first character of that word in the array. Um, so that's how, sort of, yeah, that, that's title casing it effectively. And just to show you the log here, if I do that, and there we can see the output. Um, so there's just an example, like the last word, so pot, we're pushing to our new array. Um, the word at position zero, so that would be P in this case, two uppercase, and then the rest of it, because um, we're slicing off um, from well position one. Obviously, it starts at zero, so if I did zero here, um, you would see we're also adding that. But if position one, um, that will then sort of put out the rest of the word, which we've already split to lowercase, oh, sorry, when we split it. Um, so we don't need to mutate anything else here. And yeah, essentially that is my solution to the title case a sentence. Um, let me know if you have a, a better solution or um, faster one, but yeah, look forward to seeing what you might be able to come up with and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.